Hello guys, how are you doing? So I made a couple of videos a while ago. Uh, it was about uh, building a blog application with React, Redux and Firebase. So I made a five part and then I took a break for a couple of weeks. So I'm back again and I'm going to start again. Okay, so I'm going to continue this series. So if you go to the uh, any of the video you can see in the description that we, I have left a link for the the code repo okay so I even lost from my own computer where it is now I don't know so thankfully I had uh, pushed to github so what I'm going to do I'm going to clone from there and you can follow along with me or you can clone and start from this video or if you've been following me from the previous ones then you can just get on to that straight away okay so let me get ready so terminal I go inside um, go inside the react folder I have here and I create new this project react redux firebase blog awesome okay so git clone and then paste that here Okay, so once it is done, I'll be back, all right? Let's see, yeah, CD, let me copy this, it's quite long. Copy, paste, CD into that, and then I'm going to run npm install, okay? Or you can use yarn, whichever you prefer. And I'll be back when it's done, thank you. I thought it would take a while but it's pretty quick as you can see it's only eight seconds <laughs> I guess so let's go back to the folder project folder okay what I'm going to do is go to that folder react and this is the one okay so let me drag it in sublime text Okay, so this is the folder structure. Let's uh, have a look. Let's run it and let's see if it is still working. So, yarn start. Awesome. Okay, so it looks like it's working. Let me go open up the Firebase as well. Let me check the database which one I'm using. Five is today. So this one project ID React blog eight to nine. Okay. Okay, so let's go. That's one React blog. Okay, let's open it up so that we can see uh, how it's changing. Okay, we should have one note, one blog post. Okay, we had few. All right, so we tested few of them. So what I'm going to, what I want to do in this video is, I want to. Um, show them in our page okay so here we can create let's create post yeah post yeah it's working so next thing i want to do is i want to um first of all we have to clean this up once we post it has it has to go away and then next we can show here down below okay so what i can do to begin with in this video because since it's been quite long already with the setup i'm just going to fix that up okay so let's go to source components app let me hide the sidebar okay so once we have saved on handle submit we push to the database and then what we want to do is we want to reset this state and make it um, empty string right so once we push we can say set state method and we can use this method 
to clean that up title make it empty and then body also make it empty save all right let's try again post now this set state title okay so when we uh, when we post uh, post it, it's not uh, clearing up even after set state okay so it's, that's because uh, these components this HTML uh, input field text area they have their own state okay so react has no control over that so we can make them um, we can control them and we can um, that that uh, that method is called uh, controlled components okay so how we're going to do that is input as you can see they have no value so what I'm going to do is I'm going to explicitly define the value based on the state okay so the value will be state title okay so value this state title so this this is how it becomes controlled component okay so that's what it's called in react so tell body input uh, this state body okay so the title and body now its value is bound to the state okay so as soon as the state cleans up it should work okay let's give it a try try okay perfect so we can clean this up great so in the next video we're going to render all the posts in the um, in here all right i'll see you in the next video and i'm sure you, you like this video all right don't you okay otherwise you wouldn't be watching right so if you like and you want to you are interested in watching more and more of videos uh, based on this series you know this, i will be keep adding new, new videos so maybe you guys can like subscribe share with your friends you know so that uh, that can encourage me to do more and more videos all right so i'll see you in the very next video thank you